everyone this is bill from linden tennessee i want to do a, a little video showing some results that i came up with some pretty shocking alarming results that i came up with so i've done some videos on my youtube page about this uh electric lawnmower that i converted i did this original conversion about four years ago three or four years ago and i converted the electric the gasoline riding lawnmower the murray there uh, just to electric so that the electric a single electric motor was running the deck and the tractor and and that was it um, And then eventually I Altered that because it was kind of a rotten lawnmower and just made it an electric tractor. I moved the Electric motor from where it was in the engine compartment to uh, back here Just directly driving the transmission um, That did a few things for me. It gave me a little bit of efficiency because I'm not transmitting power through drive belts, uh, but it also made it much, much faster. Uh, this little dude does almost 30 miles an hour. It's kind of obscene. Um, but then I was without a lawnmower, so I got a hold of some old Cub Cadet riding lawnmowers from the 70s, and I think one of them from the 60s. That's my next project uh, after the Jeep's done. And got the mower deck off of it. It was in really, really good shape. No rust at all. 48-inch mower deck. And took the... Uh, Took an electric motor, 48 volt, uh, DC brushed electric motor. I think it's five horsepower continuous and 15 peak, uh, but I've just got it running directly off of the same traction uh, battery pack that's on the, the tractor there. So um, it basically is just a switch under the seat. You flip the switch and it makes the lawnmower work. It's got some belts in. That's all there is to it. So, but the purpose of this video is not to talk about this lawnmower, uh, other than the fact that it's electric. Now, my yard is just about an acre, um, and it takes this lawnmower, pulling, pulling that trailer around, it takes it an hour, it takes it one hour to do it, and I had got a hold of uh, a friend of mine's mm, gasoline tractor, this Husqvarna here, 24 horse, or it was a 27 horse, Husqvarna 42 inch, uh, 44 inch, 48 inch also uh, riding lawnmower. And it didn't run, but I made it run. And I thought it'd be a cool idea just to um, fill up the fuel tank to full, cut the grass, see how long it took, and then see how much gasoline it took. Well, it turns out it took the exact same one hour to cut the, my yard as the electric tractor does, and it used one gallon of gasoline. I know that because I filled it up uh, to the line right there, and... Whenever I was finished, I came back and uh, poured some gasoline into a gallon jug and poured that into the fuel tank, and lo and behold, it was almost exactly one gallon. One gallon, if you didn't know, is about 34, some people say 37, kilowatt hours worth of energy. To do the same yard in the same amount of time, it takes 2.5 kilowatt hours of battery energy. And all that's coming from two... Chevy Volt with a V, Victor if you're military, Chevy Volt modules, they come out of the entire Chevy pack that's 16 kilowatt hours, but this is just two modules. Each of these modules are about, uh, you know, one and a half or so kilowatt hours, um, and I've just got them running parallel, and yeah, so that's kind of alarming to me because two and a half kilowatt hours is one sixteenth of the energy as a gallon of gasoline said a different way, that lawnmower over there uses 16 times more energy to do the same amount of work as this does. Say it another way, I could cut my grass 16 times, basically an entire summer, on one gallon of gasoline. So, uh, there you go. That was just a shocking to me. I didn't. I knew it was going to be different. Uh, this here little smart car, this is electric also, and it gets about four times better efficiency than uh, the same uh, gasoline-powered smart car, if you look at a you know, gasoline-equivalent energy comparison. But the lawnmower gets 16 <laughs> times. So, And um, one other cool thing, uh, I know Tesla's uh, all, or not Tesla, what's the truck company that's all, oh, Ford. Yeah, just came out with their truck, and they're talking about how you can uh, run your house off of your um truck off to the engine of the traction pack in your truck well i've got a 48 volt uh 2000 watt inverter on this tractor so 
all I have to do is just plug the inverter to that uh, little connector right there. And I could actually run a few things in the house if I wanted to. Uh, but this is really handy because I can go drive around the, the, you know, the place and run a power saw or uh, any other electrical equipment. Anyway, I digress. So I thought you might enjoy that and I uh, thought it was some interesting findings. Thanks for watching.